Okay, guys, make sure to watch the whole video. You'll be happy. Man, haven't done this in a while. Hello, it is me, Cyclonic Silver, also known as Clinton S. Cyclonic Silver, Clinton S. Silver, Clinton S. Silver, Clinton S. Cyclonic Silver, Clinton S. Cyclonic Silver, Clinton S. That's me. <laughs> wow. What's up, guys? It's Clinton S. And I am here to show a few pieces that I've been working on for the past couple days. Now, the reason why I've worked on these pieces right here, oh, you don't see any. Uh, ah, there we go. There's one, two, three. Where's the other ones? Where's the other ones at? Ah, it's hiding from me. Four. Five. Okay. The reason why I worked on these pieces was because I wanted to pour some silver. And I am doing sand casting now. I'm doing pouring into graphite molds, doing just random pours. And this is what I came up with. This is what I like to do. I like the randomness of it. So random. Ta-da. Anyway, speaking of random, have you ever wondered if flies actually look at poop and think, hmm, this is going to taste good? I don't know. Kind of random. Anyway, back to the pieces. <laughs> so these are um, the textures that I have poured the textured pocket pieces, I guess you would call them. And um, I'm enjoying pouring them. I like the randomness of them. Like I said, once again, with the word random. And I like the change. You know, I don't want to pour into a mold all the time. I don't want to pour into sand all the time. I like doing these little pieces. So that's what I've done. So this is my sort of almost kind of like a anatomical heart hand pour texture. It's pretty cool. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot. <laughs> anyway, I had a kind of an issue right there with the stamping. It is 0 0.92. I could put it on the scale right now if you want to see. But if not, I can just go ahead and show you this. Oh, do you want to see? Do you want to see? Do you, you right there. You Do you want to see? Okay, fine. Oh, man. I wish there has to be that one person that wants to see. Let's go ahead, pull out the scale. Get this right here. Go like this, open it up, put that over, hit that button, tear it out. And let's see if we can see this. I'm gonna to have to move the camera just for you. You, that one person that wanted to see exactly how much it weighed, here you go. Everybody else, please stand by. Let's see if we can get this. See, like I said, 0.92. Are you satisfied now? Are you happy? Okay. So, this piece right here. And get this out of the way again. Go back to this. There we go. 0.92 OZT. Cleaned up pretty nice, but I like it. Small piece. Really like it. And here we go with these ones. Now, look at that texture. Look how deep those valleys and crevices. Are you saying crevices or crevices or crevasses or maybe, I don't know, dips and valleys? Nooks and crannies? Hmm. English muffins. 
Mm. Anyway, let's get back to this. Come on, get with it. This one is 0.91 OZT. There's a little cyclone, cyclone right there. See it? Ooh, almost looks like that one. <gasps> but yeah, this piece is cool too. I like it. I like all these texture pieces. I'm having fun with them. And this is the first time I poured the dots one. Da 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 dots. One, two, three, four, five. You know what? I'm not going to count the dots. You guys can count the dots if you like. See? There you go. That should be enough time for you to count. This one is 0.99 OZT. And you're wondering. Why I didn't put 1.0? Well, because it didn't come up 1.0. It came up 0.99. So that's why I put 0.99. I know it's not far off of one ounce, but that's like having $999,999. You don't have $10,000, do you? No. You have $999,000. Nine hundred ninety-nine thousand dollars. Nine hundred ninety-nine. Oh my goodness! I don't know. I don't know. Nine hundred and ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine dollars. Okay, let's start this again. All right, guys. There we go. So, enough rambling. <laughs> yeah, but this has turned out point nine nine. So I stamped it point nine nine. And you can see a double stamp on the cyclone right there. It happens. It's fun. It's a random piece. I like it. And this one right here. Jesus, this video is at 6 minutes and 50 seconds right now. Ah! Hurry up. Hurry up. People don't have time. People don't have time. All right. This is a dual texture piece. Now, I did the uh, dual texture with the circles and the lines, crevices. And I really enjoy how it turned out. Shout out to Sandy, my honey. She said, hey, why don't you pour them on both? I said, okay. So there I did, and it turned out pretty good. So there we go. This is 2.40 OZT, I'll destroy. Got the little cyclone guy up there. Yeah, but this is really cool. I like how the two different textures feel. It's like... You know, left and right, or, or if you're holding it this way, left and right, or right and left, and you know, hey, different sides, different strokes, different strokes for different folks. Anyway, and here's another one. I like this one too. This one, the, the big, this one, the big one. Let's see if we can zoom out on this one. That's a big one. That's a big one. And this one, 2.44 OZD. Ooh, shiny. Yeah, I, as you can see, when I was stamping, I got my fingerprints all over it, and now it's not as shiny as it was, but it is still shiny, so, yeah. All right, guys. Well, these are the five pieces I've done in the past couple of days. And I enjoy doing them. And I like the textures. I like the randomness of it. I like being able to just pour and not worry about a certain shape and not worrying about if my vent lines are correct or if I'm over pouring the mold. I like being able to just pour. So this is what I've done is just pour. Pour these five pieces. These five right here. Now, if you guys, right there, any of you guys out there, hey, you, hey, you got something on your nose. Ew, ew. Anyway, any of you guys out there want any of these, feel free to drop me a comment. But don't forget to smash the like, subscribe, share it out if you want. I'd be excited with that. Somebody sharing one of my videos, man. Anyway. But seriously, if you guys are interested in any of these pieces, uh, drop me a comment. Let me know. These pieces down here are all less than an ounce. And these two are, this one's 2.40, this one's 2.44. We can work something up. All right, guys, you have a great day. 
Thanks for listening to my rambling and my ramblingness, ramblingness, or just have a great day, guys. Bye. Man, happy I finally, finally got done with it. Ugh. Boy, I was just rambling, 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 rambling. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Snap back in there. Put this up. Oh. You're still here. <laughs> Rambling. Yeah. All right, guys. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Uh, that was the scale I used. But, yeah, thanks for watching. And um, I guess I will get back to you guys. Get back to you guys soon. All right. Nothing like. There's a fly fly around. What? God. No. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. See you later. Bye. Bonus clip. Guys, this one right here did not make the cut. I like it. It's got sharp edges, low. Sharp edges are never a good thing. And you can't really hear it. It has like a hollow sound to it, but it's not hollow. No, I didn't clean it up or anything yet, but this one did not make the cut. It'll probably get remelted. So there you guys go. A little bonus clip for you. For all the people that decided not to just fast forward through the blah, 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 get to see the piece, this piece right here. I actually think I might keep it. Pretty cool. I'll clean the back up. Yeah. Let's see what this one weighs. Real quick, real quick. Come on. Come on. Other people want to come. We gotta hurry up. Gotta see. Gotta see. Alright, tear it out. Let's see what did this one weigh. 0.68. Cool. Cool. Alright. You guys got to see. You guys. You guys got to see. <laughs> you got to see the bonus piece. Woohoo. All right. See you later. Bye. All right, guys. So there's the video. I haven't done a fun video in a while. And man, it felt good. I don't know if I'm getting too serious or I don't know what's going on, but hope you enjoyed. If you like the random pieces that I poured, Drop me a comment. Let me know. We can work something out. And I'll see you on the next one. Have a great day. Later.